This is Red Wizard 52. And this is a uh, relaxing let's play of Warhammer Age of Sigmar Stormground. And yeah. Um only did one other episode, this is episode two. And I don't really know a lot about this game, just taking it slow. Um I love the, I don't know if you can hear the uh sound effects uh for uh Thanator's uh, Mance the screams in the background. It's pretty cool. Um yeah, we have a gate here, we have crazy rib cage tower here. Um this was the tutorial uh skirmish. I'm gonna move on to this, the West Battlements. Destroy all enemies. A procession of ghasts is entrenched in the West Battlements. Put them to rest. So I wish I could look into the um move. when I move my cursor over there, um it goes away, but I don't know what that first thing is. I'm looking at the enemy war band. Um, one of them I've already faced. I think it's the... Uh, I don't know what they're called. I forget what they're called. But the difficulty is one of five. And the reward is a skill. Um, a tank class common and war gear common. So it sounds like it's worth it. So we're going to go here. Oh! All right, I can, now I can click on the war gear. But no more information. So we're going to the west battlements. See what happens here. All right, improving your warband. Every warband must have one hero. Your hero occupies the top slot of your warband. It's a Freya Skyhelm. Strengthen your warband. Select the slot to add a new unit to your warband. Okay. So, okay. Add the castigators. It doesn't like I have much of a choice. If I get selected a farming. Okay. War spoils. War spoils from your victories on the field can be seen here. You strengthen your warband. Take to the battlefield to showcase your new strength. Alright, I will take to the battlefield very soon. But first, um, that's a locked army painter. That's cool. Miracle zero, tribute zero. I figured out that this is damage, this is defense, this is um, hit points, and this is move. And not sure what those mean. I still don't know what that means. Um, okay. I look at my war spoils. Okay. So war spoils. Won't let me click. I had some lore. I wanted to um, access the lore. I wish there was a way of doing that. I guess it's making me click start vision. We'll see if Cast I can... Cast me to the field! I will be your light in the darkness, your lightning bolt of retribution! So, summon hero. Every battle begins by summoning your hero from your warband to the battlefield. Select Freya Skyhelm from the warband and then select the valid hex to summon her to the battlefield. Alright, we're gonna do that. Alright, Freya. I wonder which valid hex I'm going to select. The armies of righteousness come! Nice. Power. Alright, so now we know what those um, purple gems mean. Power is a resource used to summon additional units from your warband. You'll earn an increasing power, increasing amount of power per turn. Unspent power is converted to a fear at the end of your turn. Alright. A fear is what you use to do the um, uh, skills on your units. Spend your three power to summon a squad of castigators from your warband. Select the castigators from uh, the warband and then select a valid hex. All right. So how do I do that? Um, oh, I, oh, all right. I see. I guess castigators. Probably gonna put them here. <laughs> castigators, take the high ground. The slope may slow us, but once it is ours, we can strike down the enemy from greater ranges. All right. So... There we go. I guess Glory I can't, to Azir and the free can't do that peoples. yet, but... I wonder why I can't move them yet. I can move her, but I can't move them. Anyhow, moving up here. Make sure. Okay. We have no Aether yet. A 
war chest and law cash bless this battlefield. I shall secure each in your name, Lord Sigmar. I could have swore in the first battle I ended winning some war. Something about her being bitten by cold steel, but I wasn't able to read that. This is a lore cache. I remember watching other Let's Plays and seeing people gather these. But I thought like, I guess I didn't gather one, but you know, I feel like there's lore that I have not read yet, and that bothers me. So I don't have any other units to summon, I guess. Because it just says zero here. Um, I guess. And then this is a four uh, power. Hopefully that becomes a fear at the end of my turn. We're definitely going to get ready. these castigators on the raised terrain. We have better firing range at this vantage. All right. And should I move? Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and take this war chest. I think that means Freya is going to get attacked by who are these? Okay, chain grasp hordes. How about this one? Chain rasp hordes. That's all I see right now. Okay. Chain rasp hordes. I thought there was another type of unit that would be attacking us. Nice. The sound effect. Was These cool. war spoils will aid our cause. They surely will. Earn war gear, skills, or even new units to equip to your warband by collecting war chests and winning battles. Hopefully, that was a unit. Warbands can only be changed between battles on the warband menu. After the battle is won, be sure to review and equip your new war spoils before starting your next battle. Now we'll do that. I wonder what I got. It's kind of cool. She can't move. Freya is done. We have no Aether yet, because I don't see any blue little... I see power, but no Aether. How about these guys? It doesn't look like it costs anything. I'm thinking they're going to come here, because they're going to try to attack Freya, but they can't, yeah, I'm thinking they're going to come here, Let's see. delayed attack, alright, I missed, aha, excellent, so, I don't want to charge here, so I could charge, but that will leave them to go back and get my castigators. I want, I want them to focus on Freya. So what I'm, what is, what I'm my commitment what is, is absolute. Shield wall, or that applies plus one armor to adjacent allies. Well, that's not relevant right now. And then um, what's this? Okay, retaliation uh, when charged. Deal three damage to attacker. Okay. And then tank class. Tank have unique abilities per unit type. It can have higher armor or health. Okay. So I'm gonna have her. We have two Aether, which is awesome. Can they reach them? Okay. So well, why not? I, I couldn't think of reason why not to do that. And. Yeah, I'm just gonna have her charge, uh, challenge them. So they attack her and she retaliates. I need to wrap my mind around why you should charge and not, I'm sorry, challenge rather than charge. I guess it's because if you kill, then you'll occupy the space. So an attack that's a charge is also a move. Sometimes you don't want to move. It's, it's, uh, you know. Tactically, not a good idea to um, to charge. Whoa, Sigma, do not forsake All right. Me. So I guess that's. I guess they're going to be spawning there. Right? Can I reach? Right, so I'm going to do that. If there's a monster that's going to appear there. Then I'm going to. Duty, uh, honor, justice. It shall be there. so. Because I want this lore cash. What's this? Hammer slam. Knockback. Target. One hex. Interrupt channeling and knockback. Okay, I guess your enemies, when they're channeling, it might be important to um, you know, stop them from channeling if you know they're going to get you. 
but that's that's irrelevant right now. And then I remember that I have a um, cooldown for some abilities. So yeah, let's see if this um, channeling thing works. All right. Okay, these are a different type of unit. Blade, heist, revenants. What does that mean? What do they do? I can't. I want to select them so I can see what what that ability does, but I guess I can't. That really annoys me because my decision on where to move would be determined by what they what they can do. I don't know what they can do. So. I will liberate the realms. I guess I'm gonna. I really want this lore cache, so. Um. Alright, I'm going here. I think it was a bad decision, but. The, uh. The carrot is working. And. We cleanse from afar. I will have them. I'm thinking they're gonna go. Can I, can I tell what their uh, move is? So their move is two. So they're gonna come towards me. They're gonna say it. They're gonna try to get me. Because. The last time, uh, the last battle, the baddies went towards the castigators. So I'm thinking they're going to come here. Unless, of course, does it cost an extra movement to go down one? I'm gambling. There. I'm thinking it probably costs an extra point of movement to go down one. And so that means that this unit's going to go here, and I'm going to get them. That's my thought. We'll see if it's right. Well, I was wrong, but okay, definitely getting this lore because that's what I came in for. Awesome. A cache of lore to be studied after the battle is won. Absolutely, we will study that lore. Um, that's part of my uh, favorite part of like Warhammer games in general is the lore is so in depth and um, it's almost like sublime like you can't really learn it all there's always another novel to read or another book um, so collecting lore you have collected a lore cache transcribed within is a piece of ancient histories of Shaish the realm of death there are many more pieces of lore to collect scattered across all the battlefields of the realms you can study the lore you have collected between battles by reviewing the lore tab on the war spoils menu all right I will um, review that lore. I guess. Um, yeah, I guess I still have some move left. Um, I'm gonna challenge. Because. Cruel blow, but not a fatal. I don't want them going to my. Uh, So they have movement of two, I'm pretty sure. So they're gonna come here. That's my thought. So I'm gonna do channeling right there. I wonder if you play this PvP. I mean, clearly your human opponent wouldn't do that. Like, why would you be? Maybe you don't. If you're doing PvP, you wouldn't see where the channeling target is. That's probably how they how they stop it. Take it. That was a mistake anyway. I thought they were going to go after the castigators. So... I'm going to take retaliatory, retaliatory damage, but... Um, yeah, why not? I think I got Advancing it. I mean, in name. The most they could do is two damage, and I have six hit points left, so... I think there's no more waves coming. There are no more waves coming. So I'm fine. I, they, they, they couldn't kill me if they wanted to. Ah, not falter now. Ah! This wasn't very hard at all. I guess it, it truly was easy. Um, question. Um, is this something where like they get experience based upon the kills they specifically get? Or do they get experience for completing the battles? So like... Am I incentivized in having the castigators kill this thing? 
for having Freya. Duty, honor, justice. So what I want to do is I'm to from to afar. Right, play it real safe. And have the oh the all right now I understand how, why the blade heist revenants are different because they have one uh, armor. I don't think that the the other ones had armor. So I really wish you could look at the units. Maybe in between battles you can look at the units. Okay, so intern. Witness. Cleanse from afar. Okay. So I want to see if they get experience. Plus 100 experience. Okay. So it looked like the experience went to my castigators. So we got a victory. Awesome. High impact Warhammer. Liberators. Nice. Got another unit. Three damage, one armor, five hit points, two movement, and they cost four to summon. Pretty awesome. And then the new challenge. Reduce, cooldown, or challenge. That's a skill, I guess. Okay. Chest rewards. Bloodstained bolts. Ranged attack. Bleed target. Nice. And then lore rewards. Um, on the hunt, three. You know I was first taught to hunt in this room. Of course. All right. Yeah, so they got a little bit more experience than Freya. Um. All right. Well, I guess uh, I'm gonna end it here. I guess it won't let me look at my. Here, I'm gonna back up. Are you sure you want to return to the main menu? All progress will be saved. We know this already, but what sucks is I'd like to end the episodes by like um, equipping my uh, new skills and new uh, you know, uh, weapons and this and that, um, looking at my new units, but I guess I can't do that until the next episode when I select the battle and I start going through it. So I guess we'll just do that with the next episode. This was fun. Episode 2 It's pretty good, and um, yeah, we're moving on to the Sacrarium. Once a sacred place, now a ruin. Destroy the enemy warband that desecrates it. Alright. Thank you very much, and we'll 